Wallflowers. Sometimes two, other times three. In morning's chill, the old women come away from tendings in solitary gardens. They who live like tulips all in a row emerge. One meticulously prunes an elaborate rose garden and drives a big black van with the license plate frame, I love my baby grand, although the piano is never heard from the street. One between manages a small apartment building. The third, who lives in a rambling old house with a wide front porch, has a grown daughter who stores hay in her garage and lives far away in her own dream of horses. A daughter who will sell this house as soon as her mother dies. The three time-weathered women stand together on the sidewalk in front of the low wall red brick, turn their backs to the busy street, tempt some cosmic firing squad, wave wisping ashen cigarettes hooked in calloused, wrinkled, sun-spotted hands, blow smoke, talk in deepening tones. These days, mostly about what they know or have heard about trees, flowers, garden pests, other people's lives.